Hi everyone, it's Monday, and I haven't told you about the hermit crab in a while. I think I pretty much covered that every time I walk down the hall, my neighbor at the end of the hall closes her door. She leaves it open almost all the time for airflow or something, I'm really not sure. But she can sense when you're coming, probably because she can hear you coming. You can tell the door's open because it's a dark hallway and it lets light in, and so if you're walking down it, every time, pretty much without fail, it just slowly closes, enveloping the hallway in darkness and I don't know how she does it. Seriously, she, I don't think she, I think she just sits by her door and closes it, but the, it, it, it gets weirder than that. I don't know if she's got some sort of hidden ninja skills or what is going on, but it also occurs a lot in the bathroom because we have to share a bathroom among everybody on this hallway. And you don't always see people, you know, going in there or whatever, but you do cross paths with people. But when I cross paths with her, she gets out of there very quickly, but not, obviously like it's not like she sees me coming and runs she'll even say you know hi good evening you know i'm like hi good evening and literally as soon as my back is turned to her like i go to open one of the doors to one of the stalls by the time i've turned around she's gone she'll be brushing her teeth i don't even know why she brushes her teeth in there she has her own sink but she'll be brushing her teeth or washing her hands or using i don't know but she just she just disappears and dashes behind doors whenever she can if you're in the area it's crazy and I will get in there and know that she's in there and maybe she's behind a door or something I will use the bathroom and almost instantaneously she just vanishes I went to the doctor today and I'd really hoped to have some really awkward or funny story about going to the doctor but it actually turned out to be really nice I was kind of apprehensive and I've needed to go for a long time because I've got kind of this head cold nastiness they can't do anything for my face unfortunately they did tell me that but it was really nice the guy was really friendly he was a little bit late of course but I mean what he's a doctor the whole visit only cost me 23 euros granted that the trip to the pharmacy afterwards cost me more but 23 euros to see the doctor he was like here you can use this to build your insurance if you want and I was like that's okay I think I can cover 23 euros so unfortunately no ridiculous or painful story from that but enough about the hermit crab how about some news I have a couple of things to announce or say I've already announced them but just to let you know if you only follow me here on YouTube I have taken a job as Mercy Ships PR coordinator and will be joining the ship in the Congo for a year. I'll actually be headed to the Canary Islands to join the ship and then sail down. If you don't know much about Mercy Ships, I'll include links below. But basically, I'll be sailing down with them in July and for the 10-month field service, we'll serve as the PR coordinator for Mercy Ships in the Congo. I think that about covers it. Before you go crazy, we're talking about the Republic of the Congo, not the Democratic Republic of the Congo, which is quite a mouthful to say. This is an important difference because the Democratic Republic of the Congo, we'll just call it DRC from now on, is where all of the you know rebels and fighting and nasty gorillas that kill you with stone paddles are. The Republic of the Congo, however, is none of those things and is where I will be living for 10 months. So if you would like to know more about the Congo, so would I, but I'll try to tell you more as I learn more. This of course means an end to French Fridays in the near future because, well, you know, I won't be living in France anymore. Of course, I could always talk about France, but I think I'll probably pull on other subjects. Like I said, if you don't know much about Mercy Ships, you should check out the 60 Minutes piece that I've linked below or go to the website or you can go to my Mercy Ships e blog and you can check out some information there. Uh, so please subscribe to my channel and I will see you on Friday for French Friday, although it's going to be a challenge because I have a lot of people coming to visit me in the next couple of days. Like a lot of people coming in, which I'm excited about, but it's going to make doing vlogs a lot more challenging. So anyways, I'll see you hopefully on Friday. And if I don't, I'll see you sometime after that. Okay.